seen my previous video i had asked one question can mm -hmm. we get equality here okay so so answer is yes we get equality bit of mn is equal to bit of nm so let us prove this thing okay we will start with left hand side i am going to use definition of beta function what is it i will write here by definition beta of mn you are familiar with the definition of beta function integration 0 to 1 x raised to m minus 1 1 minus x raised to n minus 1 dx so this is the definition of beta function so i am going to put x is equal to 1 minus t here so putting x is equal to 1 minus t so if you put our first task is to find its derivative and our second task to change its mm -hmm. limits let us find derivative derivative of x is 1 so dx derivative of 1 is 0 derivative of t is 1 so there is minus sign so minus 1 dt right after that we will find new limits for x is equal to 0 and for x is equal to 1 okay so let us find new limits if i put x is equal to 0 here we will have t is equal to 1 and if i put x is equal to 1 here we will have t is equal to 0 okay so yeah we have new limits and dx is equal to this thing we have got x is equal to 1 minus t let us put all those things in a this integration therefore beta of mn is equal to integration 0 to 1 right x means 1 minus t so 1 minus t raised to m minus 1 into i don't have space there huh? so i'm writing here 1 minus 1 minus what is my x 1 minus t i'm going to put there see there is already minus sign outside so sign will get changed and we will have 1 plus t raised to n minus 1 into i suppose to write minus dt since you know dx is equal to minus 1 dt right so see i the integration limit should be 1 to 0 since our new limits are 1 to 0 okay this is equal to what will happen 1 to 0 this minus sign will come outside right so 1 minus t raised to m minus 1 1 minus 1 will get cancelled t raised to n minus 1 dt so are you familiar with the property of definite integration if there is minus sign how to remove simply change the limits of integration the minus sign will get vanished so therefore here what will happen 0 to 1 t raised to n minus 1 1 minus t raised to m minus 1 dt so here we have a variable t you can replace it by x y doesn't matter if you change the variable value of the integration will remain same so that's why i can write simply integration 0 to 1 x raised to n minus 1 1 minus x raised to m minus 1 dx oh, so here dx so yes this is definition of beta function right this is definition of beta function beta of what we add 1 in power of x so n minus 1 is there if you add 1 we will have n and here also we add 1 so m minus 1 plus 1 that means we will have m so yeah did you notice we started with beta of mn and finally we got beta of nm so in this way we proved yes both of them are equal if you want you can make a screenshot of it then we will go further i am giving these two problems for exercise okay so these are very simple okay try on your own otherwise in next video i'm going to discuss it okay let's try for these two problems okay thank you bye bye